A lot of people be talking about how they have diarrhea, so <laughs> I think it's a lot. I gotta remind myself not to hang out with Vincent and his friends. I'm gonna get pooped all over. Hey, it's your friend Tangerine with another episode of D-Herb Street Smart, and today we're talking about irritable bowel syndrome. We gotta talk about it. What is your name and where are you from? My name's Vincent. I'm from the San Gabriel Valley. Kenny from Glossop Park? Yeah. Echo Park. Are you ready? Yes. Excellent. Before we even start, do you know what IBS stands for? No, I don't. <laughs> but you're ready to answer the questions about it. Well, I, I, I'm trying. I love this about you. What does irritable bowel syndrome cause? Is it A, diarrhea, B, constipation, C, both? Both. A, diarrhea. Both. How do you know? Yeah, I have it. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. I'm constipated, <laughs> diarrhea, everything. Ding, 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 both is correct. Yay, Katie's got one right. I'm so glad you knew the answer because you're living it. IBS is a disorder where your brain doesn't communicate well with your gut. And because of that, it causes your intestines to contract. It causes abdominal pain, constipation, diarrhea, and other problems. Got it? Got it. We're learning together, Vince. True or false? Men are more likely to get IBS than women. False. False. True. What makes you say that? Uh, as a man and part sometimes having had it, I can only guess. What makes you say false so quickly, sir? I would just think it would be equal. Nothing's equal in this world, Kenny. But you know what? You're also right. Ding, 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 ding. False is correct. I think I would have guessed the same thing because I always picture men with IBS, but uh, the answer is false. Actually, women are twice as likely to get it than men. And actually, I didn't know this until today, but women are more likely to get autoimmune diseases in the first place. It's hard out here for us ladies, man. We gotta birth people, we gotta have a cycle. Now we're more likely to get IBS. What up, God, you don't like us? Deesh. All right, one more question, sir. You are killing it. You ready to walk away with some cash? Hmm. Sure. What percent of people have irritable bowel syndrome worldwide? Is it A, 0.5 to 1%, B, 2 to 3%, or C, 5 to 10%? I'll go with C. What makes you say that? Uh, it just seems more logical. The other numbers seem a little too low. I'm going to guess C, 5 to 10. C. C is correct. Ding, 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 ding. You got it right. C is correct. Love to guess. What made you guess C? Uh, a lot of people be talking about how they have diarrhea, so... <laughs> I think it's a lot. I gotta remind myself not to hang out with Vincent and his friends. I'm gonna get pooped all <laughs> over. So you want some cash? Here you go. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Cool. Thank you, man. <laughs> Much appreciated. Thank you, D Herbs. Thank you, D Herbs. Oh. Thank you. OMG, ladies and gentlemen, we had two winners on today's episode. That shocked me. Apparently, IBS is more common than I realized. Let us know what you learned by leaving a comment below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you on another episode of D Herbs Street Smart.